Good day, Sacramento. Molly Real live at UC Davis. And I have a question for you. What's cooler than cool? This. This is an unmeltable ice cube, kind of a jelly. This is in its unfrozen state. It was invented here at UC Davis. Cool, right? <laughs> this is it in its frozen state. And as you can see, ice, regular water ice, melted. Cool jelly UC Davis ice, still frozen. <laughs> so let's talk to the ladies who invented this unmeltable ice. This is Lushan, she's an associate professor here, and this is Jahan, a PhD student. So, you know, the more I try to think about what this is and how it works, the more my brain hurts. So can you explain what this is? <laughs> sure. This is a protein-based jelly ice cube. Uh, the idea is that having this ice tube, it will not melt and generate melting water that can cause cross-contamination between one piece of food to another. Um, yeah, this is... Um, yeah, and it's, it's antimicrobial too. Yes, yes, uh, because it has antimicrobials added in this ice cube so that it will not get moldy after multiple use. Um, and again, uh, since it does not generate melting water, it will prevent cross-contamination. Okay. Both spoilage and uh, pathogenic bacteria. Yeah, and Lushan, so we have salmon sitting on the ice there, and it's a great demonstration because seafood is what inspired you yeah. to create this. Yes, yes, because I work with the seafood industry before. Uh, we are impressed by the amount of ice they use to make sure their products are cooled and chilled. So that's why uh, we have this idea, why don't we develop some new type of ice so that we can save the water used by the seafood industry. So with the USDA National Institute of Food and Agriculture, we are able to develop this prototype. I mean, the implications for the planet are huge. If you think about all the things that you use ice to uh, keep cold, to keep frozen, it's so much. Uh, and then, Jahan, you want to take it a step further and make this protein ice even more sustainable. Yes, so at this stage, it's still in concept proving. Um, so we are including something that's available in the market directly. Uh, but in the future, we hope we can make it more environmentally friendly by including all um, raw materials from agricultural byproducts. In that way, it could be um, more sustainable and even more compostable. Amazing. Cool things happening at UC Davis, you guys. I wish you could all just see it. <laughs> it is hard to wrap your brain around what it could be, but uh, it is cool, isn't it? That's ice right. It's cold. It's as cool as a ice Davis cold. ice cube. <laughs> Ah, uh, there we go. That's the new saying now. Yeah. <laughs> can you pour whiskey over it? <laughs> of course. That's, that can you awkward. can you pour whiskey over it? <laughs> she said in th in th in theory. <laughs> theoretically, yes, because it's made with protein. Yes, theoretically you can use it, uh, but we are not at that stage yet. <laughs> Theoretically, yes, please don't. <laughs> Thank you. Congratulations. Thanks, Molly.